the lights are turned on in the state of Maryland. This is something that creates jobs. And when film is made in Maryland, our small businesses go to work. The real faces are the uh, average working man and woman in the state of Maryland who are benefiting from this legislation. When a film production comes to Maryland, it dumps millions of dollars into the local economy. And that's not just jobs, but it's all kinds of stuff. And all of that's going into local businesses. I mean, the tax incentives have been great because it keeps the business rolling in here. But one of the best things about it was during the winter months, which is usually the slow months in any building trade, where most places have to lay off people, we actually had to hire guys last winter because of House of Cards. Whenever a movie production company comes to town, they ask for something called layout board. It's not a term we really use here in Baltimore, but we, we came to learn what they need for layout board, and now we carry that. And we found there's a whole lively market that is built up around it. My crew and I, um, we build, paint, fabricate, um, everything that's needed for any given production. And actually, I have a total of at least 83 vendors that I use, and that's just for construction, paint, you know, any steel we buy, anything in our, in our world. It doesn't include the cater, which buys a ton of food locally. And it's great for them because they have their regular customers they probably had for years, and all of a sudden this other group, us, come in, and we're spending, like, lots of money. I know oftentimes people say, oh, you know, it's, it's Hollywood is coming into Maryland, but you know what? It really is, you know, thousands of individuals working. House of Cards uses over a thousand Maryland firms in its, in its production process. That's a thousand Maryland firms that are benefiting from this film production in the state of Maryland. We have a, a lot of reasons people might want to come and travel here and see this place, but getting the word out, well, that's what films help us do. Uh, those television productions help us do. I can't buy that kind of advertising. We've got to inst install a credit that uh, is consistent for a long period of years so that uh, the industry will know what to expect when they come to Maryland. Our people can do any movie that anybody else can, and uh, a lot of times people don't realize that until they actually get here. And then they see, wow, you know, we, we could have just hired this guy from right here. So it's just important to have an infrastructure, to have a sustainable film industry. Anything that brings jobs is important to this county. There are thousands of businesses and, and individuals that get affected by this. So that's what the incentives have done for us, is, is brought us back to the state of Maryland, got some of my guys back off the unemployment rolls. The reason I stayed in Maryland was I saw hope. I saw this production incentive. I thought, this is giving me an incentive to stay in Maryland. You know, like the guys like myself, you know, like that did not even know that this was something that we could do. But now we have careers. It's been great working on House of Cards uh, this semester. I've gotten to meet a lot of great people. It's been a great experience. It's something that I'm very fortunate to do as a college student. Our people, our landscape, and just the workforce that we provide. So I know if I were making a film, I would choose Maryland because it has everything a filmmaker could need.